That's for babies. That's for babies. Babies. For babies. That's for babies. That's for... It's a dinner time. Gaming. Oh, I like these. Just too quiet here. out here. Well, I sleep next to some train tracks, so you can pretend. Oh, this is so cool! So, I haven't really gotten too much further, but I really hope they, like, let you decorate this room or something later. Oh, it feels, man, it if they do... It feels very, like, bland, and I feel like that's purposeful. Yeah, this seems like set up your little base thing. Maybe we can get some little dolls. Oh, that'd be fun if we could just get, like, big old Lapras doll to, to sit on. Ah, oh, yes. Auto save, good to know. But we can also save manually should we desire. Wow. It's got like a, this is honestly, I'm impressed. This is like, when it, when I think Pokemon in the future, this is what my this child what you, brain Yeah, this is what you want to imagine. Yeah. Yeah, this is definitely the, the Pokemon game I think I was always wanting. And it has me very excited. I'm cool that they shifted it up to like in the past and stuff. Yes, that's, that's, I, that's a fun I, I twist. I really like how that how that's working out. Uh, oh, a bolt of lightning. What the and hell? A, and a sound, a cry from the wilderness. I'm scared. Is this is this the birth of our savior? <laughs> uh, could be the birth of our damnation. It might be what we need a savior for. Some wild lightning last night. Hello. Anyway, come on out. I'm not going to walk into your house. I'm still a proper gentleman. Or lady. I'm is not it, sure who's out there. Is, is this where we, uh... Is there any other, like, little yeah, in, I can't remember things this. in here? Solid dresser. Solid construction. Uh, extra sets of clothing can be kept. Can be kept. So is this, uh... Do we get the change outfits, maybe? Bowling oh, yeah, 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 change outfit. Lovely stones. They're just some old stones. A, an old stone gathers none moss. But a lovely stone is covered in moss. <laughs> well a, loved. A, a loved stone is only moss, uh, and and that's our and that's our drinking water and our toilet. Oh, just use it for both. It's I thought we had like a, a, the the little community toilet. Do we have that, or is that like somewhere else? What? No, that's the trough that Pokemon use. <laughs> you didn't use that, did you? Oh my god. <laughs> The captain is waiting. We gotta go. Okay. I'm gonna very slowly walk over there. See you when you get there. Okay, so let, all right, hold on. When you, every time you're playing a little video game, mm -hmm. think like, okay, you're walking around in real life. You're walking like this. No, you're not no, hey, yeah, no, I get you. Like, you're absolutely right? right. If I ran a tenth as much as I run around in video games, uh, <laughs> I'd be in so much better shape. <laughs> Cause yeah, I'm I'm smashing that sprint button any chance I get in a game. I do the same thing. It's okay. I and then I, you play games like Grand Theft Auto where it's like, oh my god, come on, just, dumbass! Just, what do you gotta catch your breath yeah, for? What are you freaking <laughs> puss? Come on, just go. <laughs> That's exactly how I act. Against a whole pack mm. outnumbered. Yes, so speaking of, sometimes multiple Pokemon jump you and things go from bad to worse real quick. You could die. Death. You yeah. might die sooner. sooner. You might die and be dead and not alive anymore. There, You could go to sleep for a really long time. <laughs> you could get lost in the shadow dimension if you spend too much time <laughs> with Pokemon. Yeah, you could get sent into the, the place... Uh, we don't speak his name. The Forever Zone. <laughs> <gasps> she have a little Abra? Let's get straight to it. Don't mind that Pokemon in the corner. It's not there. It's just my boss, and I'm, <laughs> I'm under review, and do not look And the again. Pokemon's controlling me. Please send help. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Hello, my name is Abra. I mean, I am sil silent. <laughs> That's what they should do that sometime. That would be fun. Uh, the Doof, Starly, the anime, and Shinx. There was, a, there was a like a mini arc with like a villain that was possessed by a, a Malamar, the like squid-looking psychic Pokemon. Oh, the weird squid yeah, guy. Like, yeah, it, like possessed squid a game. woman and like made her a criminal or something. That's fun. 
All right, so if we're gonna work with the Galaxy team, we gotta prove our worth. They're not just doing handouts out here. Okay. Here, take your official Galaxy satchel. <sighs> wow. A satchel just for me. That whatever it is you're wearing doesn't suit our satchel in the least. What do they call it? Some kind of Q shirt? Some sort of shirt. It makes a shape, but I can't quite <laughs> explain it. You and your mini kimono. Okay, so we have missions on our arse phone. Arse phone will tell you where things are and what's up. So we do, like, questies instead of gym, Jimmy fights? Yeah, there's no Jimmies here. Just a bunch of questing. Okay. We, we get our my questicles uncle, My uncle order, questing. No Jimmies. Yeah. Past trials. Fill up your Pokedex. This game has much more of a focus on catching Pokemon than... I love it. Others, for obvious reasons, I feel, what with the mechanics. Best part. Boom! Boom! Plish plash! Plish -plash. I was taking a bash! Jehoshaphine. Jehoshaphine! Pick the Pokemon that strikes your fancy with a partner of your own. You'll be able to fight off wild Pokemon outside the village. Garen, we did not discuss at all what, nope. what starter we're doing. I was still very much no idea how any of this was going to happen. Yeah, uh, so, so here's our chance to choose. Full disclosure, in my file, I picked Cyndaquil, because I'm lone fire type boy, baby. Well, I'm going to also have a Cyndaquil, so I don't want Cyndaquil. Okay, well, all right. That's two votes, no Cyndaquil. I was kind of hoping you were getting something different so we could pick what was left of the third. No, we got to make the point. Okay, right, and then okay. my, my other logic here is that I think we, we've, we've, already, we've had already had We've already a had a Rowlet. We did have we, Cito. And we've never... Ago. I'm surprised you remember the name. Uh, and then we never Oshawott had... Oshawott would have Oshawott. been... We never Oshawott had a water. White? Yeah. So so yeah. So we never we never played that one. So we didn't have any starter from that gen. And yeah, I don't think we've had we've had a water starter. We had Piplup, but I think I think that means and and we had uh, Sobble also. But I think that means we were of these three. Asha Water is a new one. I want Asha Water. Let's do it. Push plash. Do you want Oshawott? Because we're also like, Samurott fits, you know, ooh, the, ooh, the, you the, know? The, the the time frame, you know? I didn't think know? about that. That's just damn on theme right there. Blip. Still making their, their bleeps and blaps for their sounds. Good. I never want them to say their names. <laughs> I mean, I don't need them to say their names. The weird bloop, bloop, bloop sounds, I think, every so often still kind of catch me. No, I, I want to, in fucking 2040, I want to catch a Bulbasaur that goes, <laughs> and it's horribly bit crushed. Yeah, every time. Cuckoo! These guys are just jealous that they're not coming with us. We'll take them. I mean, I caught them. They did go dashing from the village. Clearly, they want yeah. to be your friend, but yeah. I just, uh, you know. Boy, going out in the woods and by yourself sure is dangerous. We'll give you one Pokemon. No, 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 no. We won't give you the three Pokemon that clearly want to go with you. We'll just give you the one. I don't want to. The way this, we hope you don't. The die. way this guy, this angle right here, the way he's looking, and he says, "I'll have you assist with my research." Yes, you will be my subjects. We haven't figured out what animal cruelty is yet in this time, so <laughs> someone's got to break those barriers. They're just a bunch of meat machines. <laughs> and I am their mechanic. <laughs> they don't have souls or nothing. Could you put a soul in a Pokeball? Nope. That's why we don't fit. They don't have personalities. That's thoughts, a, you know, independent did feelings. You, so do you know that like, so there, there's this old, old theory uh, of vision called emission theory where people thought that we saw by shooting beams out of our eyes. Ooh, and okay. If, and th things existed because enough people saw them with their eye beams and that's what gave things their shape. All right. Yeah, no, that makes sense. Yeah. And I, I all I'm saying, I want to veer into that. You know, I want to hear about like crazy, uh, like medieval time theories of just let's get insane. Let's go. Let's like let's get the lore of uh, 
You have I, I want to see medieval scientists. You have to attach these wormples to your back. They'll suck the diseases out. <laughs> yeah, yeah. They suck out all your bad, uh, you know, all your bad. You're made of nothing but snot and blood and spit, right? So yeah, the, they suck the, all the bad the juices three out. Fluids, they, one of them is poison stings. Who's this guy? Is this Volkner? Vo Volo, uh, he's invest. Uh, you know, he, he's just a cool guy. He's hanging out. Kind of stand up. To oh, he's, he's a traveling Ronin, as it were. I just would like to battle. Do you know how Pokemon battles work? What a delightful find. Oh. You're about to do a trial. We need to make sure you know how to fight in the wilderness. Get your blood pumping. Your your equilibrium's low. Ginkgo Guild member, Volo. Ginkgo. The Ginkgo. Oh, so he's from the bank? Yes, that's exactly Or he's right. like a merchant? I think, I think he is like a, a, yeah, a salesman. Now, here's what I like about Pokemon battles. I can go and just suck oh out their Pokemon all I want. Yo, hey, 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 what's going on over here? What, what's, Great, this is blowing my mind. What you doing? <laughs> There's, what the fuck? Oshawa, I don't like the way this guy's looking at me. Go tackle him. Oh my god, this hey, is hey, so hey, cool! Hey, don't tell your Pokemon what to do! Yeah, hey, Dumbo! Yeah, no, don't, don't, don't look at your Pokemon, look at me, look at me! <laughs> we're, we're over here doing business, you and me. We're hey, here on the, on, we're, we're, we're on the scenes, right in the middle of a battle. Yeah, you can't move around as you're, like, directly giving orders. But no, get, get stuff. between, get right between <laughs> them. And I want to see what happens. Does it, like, hard push you out of the way when the attack happens? Uh, I think you do have, like, a little, like, whoop! animation and you move i want to get like you know no don't hit my pokemon jump in front of the flamethrower <laughs> yeah, no i really want that too i want like a dive in to take the hit so your pokemon doesn't faint that would be so good that's incredible oh my god pokemon learn new moves as they level up if you want to change moves that your pokemon can use in battle open your satchel choose the pokemon and choose the chain moves option they, they wow, so it doesn't it doesn't happen moves. after battle. Okay. I'm like meticulously picking apart all this game it's, design it's stuff. It's interesting a lot of the the mechanics they've like slightly tweaked. Uh, yeah. or like moved around. That's so Potions cool. now heal 60. I think they were 20? 50? Can't remember what they ended up being. I think they were 20. They were 20 for a long time. I can't remember if the recent games that they up. They might have been 40 or 50 recently. I don't remember. To the obsidian fields for your trial. The volcanic rock plain. So whenever you leave the village, you need to tell Ress, uh, the guardsman, where you're off to. Gotta tell dad where we're going. If something ha bad happens, people will pick you up. That's their little in-game explanation for why this is sort of like a hub place. And in order to leave, you're gonna pick. You're gonna you're, you're gonna pick it like a yeah. zone. Yes. Yeah. It gives me that kind makes of a, sense. A monster huntery vibe where it's gonna be like you're gonna have to yes. pick different places to hunt. But also gives a convenient uh, explanation for like if you get knocked out, they'll know <laughs> where you were when you never came back. <laughs> That's all. Yeah, monster. Get you. Monster hunter is a good comparison. I I can see that. Which I guess I often forget how popular Monster Hunter is. So like, it's like the biggest games, game. Other games kind of implementing its things makes a lot of sense, and I think Pokemon those hands shake perfectly. Totally. I didn't, I didn't play the uh, Monster Hunter Pokemon game, but that looks you know like a pretty good match. For the full responsibility for whatever happens from our sudden guests. So everyone still kind of isn't sure if they can trust me. I'm a stranger from a strange sky portal. Who, who knows what I'm capable of, what these Pokemons are going to do. You fell from the sky. I immediately don't trust you. And you're going to have to spend two thirds of the story to gain my trust. And then in the final act, I'm going to go, Oh, I always trusted you. It so was just you a test. Understand. I'm from the future. Where I come from, you're already dead. Oh, that looks so cool. Oh, here's, here's our Breath of the Wild moment. You see that mountain over there? You can catch it. It's called <laughs> Aspiration it's Hill. It's called a golem. <laughs> Whoa. 
Oh, and they like got like the Pokemon script, but it's like kind of yeah. ancient Japanese looking. That's neat. I also think this game's doing a lot of good stuff with its soundtrack. Like, I feel like it's going the Breath of the Wild route where it's like less memorable melodies and more like just kind of accents as you're doing stuff. Yeah. You'll get little light motifs kind of coming back yeah. in certain parts. That's cool. All right. So our trial is to catch a Bidoof, a Starly, and a Shinx. I'm scared. Can we do it? Well, there's a Bidoof right over there, but it's telling me to talk to him. If you want to pass this trial, start throwing a Pokeball at Bidoof. You got okay. it. Okay. Hey, what's up? So you can press Z, L, L2, whatever, to like lock on. Don't don't lock on. I want like. Can you free throw this? I can just free throw it also. Oh, like how how does that feel? Hey. It's uh, you know. Your typical <clears throat> aim and sh aim and throw. Badoof caught. We're on the march. Just a bit of tutorializing here for you. Badoof don't really care if they see you, but other Pokemon, maybe it's an issue. Starly might be a bit more uh, mm -hmm. panicky and quick to flee. Type to run at the drop of the hat, if you will. So you're going to have to use the little crouchy mode? Good thing we've got some tall grass and knees. <laughs> Opposable knees. <laughs> Press the same button again to rise. You creep into the tall grass while crouched low, it'll be even harder for wild Pokemon to detect. Cool. I'm going to run over here as loud as I can, and the Pokemon's not going to flee, but you better crawl over quietly. Now we are the terror that lurks yes. in the tall grass. Yeah, look, don't you go in the tall grass, Starly. There might be humans waiting for you. Gotcha! Ooh, that sounded like a good hit. Are those berries on that tree? Those are berries on that tree. How very observant of you. Hell yeah. I just want to be a good member of the survey scouts. Well, what if we collected those berries by sending our Pokemon out to fetch them for us? What? That's uh, cute. And what if that gave Oshawott a little bit of experience doing that? What? That's sick. I throw your partner's Pokemon. Oh, I guess they're going to tell me about this here. Oh. Have an item at the ready, but want to send out a Pokemon? Press X. Have a Pokemon at the ready, want to send out an item? Press X. The captain's expert on these things. <laughs> You got Pokemon ready, try aiming for certain rocks or trees. Pokemon will hunt for berries and things, and it'll bring back whatever it finds. That's your time for your partner to shine. Final hurdle, <clears throat> catching a Shinx. I want a Shinx. I love Shinx. Time to Shinx it up, baby. L L oh, and if it, if it wasn't for some reason obvious enough yet, this, this isn't a Nuzlocke. <laughs> like, uh, clearly, <laughs> since we're catching so much stuff right here, and with the way this game operates, it is not. It it would not work for that rule set. We're just we're just having fun. Yeah, we're just having having a good old time. I'm I'm really because I'm really curious to see how this game just like plays. Like this is so different. No, I really yeah. want to know it is what it changes up. So so it's the more what I say the more point. arrows it so, like yeah. Uh, when you use ZL, you can focus on the Pokemon to see how easy it might be to catch. I see arrows okay. uh, pointing up above uh, will be e the more arrows pointing up will be easier. X will appear for this. Pick to fight. Be warned. Pokemon displaying this icon cannot be caught until you engage them in battle. Cool. So, like, okay. Shinx is a naturally aggressive Pokemon. If it sees me before I throw my Pokeball, it will immediately try I to fight. I don't want to fight? Yeah. And then, do, do you still have the during battle fighty throw ball stuff? So, no. And that's kind of what I don't like. Is okay. Because it, it sort of goes back to old Pokemon when you start a fight. But, like, can you throw a Pokeball during a fight? You can, like, like in an old Pokemon game, like, hit the yes. item menu. and Yeah, item menu throw ball. Actually, I shouldn't try send Oshawa. It's an electric type, but whatever. We'll fight. We'll try it. It'll be fine. There, can you stand in between these two? I want to see what happens when you, like, stand right in the middle. Hey, how's it going? <laughs> oh, okay. So you, you get, like, I, I see. Okay, I'm just, I'm seeing how they do it. Got it. Oh, I'm like incorporeal <laughs> during attack. Yeah, yeah, you're you're like, yeah. But see now, I want to see you stand in the middle of a hyper beam. But now it's like use item, and it's just gonna be using, and then it just 
and then just shows a little cinematic. Yeah. You got it. I, yeah, I was okay. kind of wishing I could press a button to like go into throw mode so I could like, like, and maybe that would have either been too hard to do or figure out or something. Like maybe I don't know, but like I would have loved to have like made it a position thing, like knock them this way so I can throw my ball and catch <gasps> them or something. Oh my god, great! You're thinking with at least ten brain cells with that. That's awesome. <laughs> First you fall from the sky, then you go and catch all of our escape Pokemon one after another. I didn't believe this po professor story until I saw you in action for myself. Here you are, three Pokemon caught. You completed your trial. Hell yeah. We did. I it. hope this does well. I already like, anytime they do a new thing like this, there's going to be growing pains with like changing yes. up the formula. But this is so cool. I, I love... don't want them to drop this idea. I love old Pokemon. Don't get me wrong. I, I enjoyed those games. I'm ready for them to do something like this and make this the new normal. Like, it's just very, very cool to me. There's still room to put out the Boomer Pokemon games. They don't take long to make. <laughs> They're really straightforward. Also true. I'm they really crank curious those out pretty easily. Because I know there are Hisuian variants of Pokemon in this. Uh, uh -huh. I'm curious if they're going to make like a back compatibility thing for like Sword and Shield or whatever. Because that's apparently still where like all of the official like Pokemon tournament things are held. Like they didn't transfer over to Diamond and Pearl when that came out. Yeah, that makes sense. Like, but you can trade from Diamond and Pearl to Sword and Shield, right? Uh, I think you can put them in like Pokemon Home or whatever and move them that way, maybe. You can just do that way, yeah. I don't know if there's a direct between the two. I did. I did not get the brilliant diamond, shining pearl, so I I can speak with zero authority on it. I didn't either. I wasn't. No, no burning desire in my heart for for that. But this though, I was like way into, yes. and I wanted to stay. I wanted to stay really blind. I, and I almost it played the diamond and pearl remakes just in case there was like connective tissue with this somewhere, since this. Oh still feels yeah. Very like is clearly supposed to be the Sinnoh region type stuff. Yes. Yeah, I don't know if they did, like, you know, Omega Ruby final parts cool stuff yeah. in, in that game. I have no idea. Yeah, me neither. I, I did not look into it. You've passed your trial. You can hold that satchel. You impressed me. I set a high hurdle to judge whether a stranger like you would be worthy, and you cleared it. This is your official uniform of the Survey Corps. <laughs> I like that. I'm pretty sure you can hear like Abra floating over there like that. There's like a little like I sound. was hearing something and I wasn't sure what that was. That's cool. Present yourself in uniform to our commander. This is your first official order from your captain. You know what they should do to this game to make it look better is they should crank down the resolution. Yeah. They should like I think when you lower the resolution on like the models and stuff, it makes them look like a billion times more charming. Yeah, I feel like that like I'm liking this game, but that would probably be my one tick against it is I think, and I feel like this was an issue with Sword and Shield too. Game Freak is still kind of rough at these like bigger kinds of games and environments and stuff. Yeah. Uh, and like, I, I don't know. I don't know if it was, if, if it's like a model complexity thing or something, but I just feel like everything kind of moves a little weirdly or something. Like it's hard yeah, to- Yeah, and if you, I just mean like the, the rendering resolution of the camera, if you took this game and you crunched it down to be like, DS resolution, it would look better. Like those DS games look amazing. Yeah. Because you, your brain fills in the gaps, like where it gets a little jank. <gasps> different colored. Eyes. We already start off with so much stuff. We we get a bunch of different. Oh, I know what I. Oh, I know what I'm gonna do. <laughs> oh boy. Well, for our uh, little Jehosephine here, what do you think? What do you think? I, yellow eyes always catch me off guard. I think I like Ooh, it. All right. That, that's I like, like it. It fits with the little look, too. We got a bunch of yellow. I don't have any glasses yet. Okay, so we've only got our stuff we just got. There's so many fun little things. But yeah, lots of lots of categories for clothes. I think I saw a building with a haircut sign on it, maybe. So we might even have more hairstyles soon. I think our hair's perfect, but I am curious what else they have. I'm curious because I played as a boy, and I don't know if they have like gender-specific stuff. Probably, because they're cringe developer. Mm. Wonder when the captain decided to go ahead and get a uniform ready for you. I see you've changed. Regarding your accommodations, you may continue to use that room <sighs> you slept in. 
Oh, you have one big one, and we have like two ones, and the one is slightly bigger than the scarf. Mm, I like the scarf. Yeah, the, the scarf like, differentiation. Female scarf looks real good. <gasps> and we got a little uh, bandana. It's like Dawn. We're like Dawn, and he's like Pearl. <laughs> Is that his name? And actually, I think he's Diamond, and I think she's Pearl in the manga. Who's what's the what's his name? Like, because isn't it like Evan or something? Is their oh, name for like Gold Kid or whatever? What is his name? I honestly don't know. I Hang I'm on. lame, and I always pick the boys, so I usually just hear the girls' names, which is usually who they are in the anime, so it's easy to remember. Pokemon Diamond protagonist boy name. Pierre? Lucas. Lucas. All right, well, that was way off. <laughs> Yo, I love his- Here's our his commander, the man in charge, like Commander Commodo. Oh, they you say seem cool. He throws Pokemon with his, uh, uh, what's it, sumo style. How do, how do we respond? How do we talk to this it's man? It's an honor. It is an honor, sir. You know your manners. Been briefed on your situation, including on how you fell from the rift in the sky. Oh wait, we did from the the rift we by the mountain. We fell from that weird rift in the sky. And ended up on Prelude Beach. Yes, but oh. if you ask me, the rift looks like it's over a mountain. So I don't know how they're saying we fell from that. Well, we we rolled all the way down, yeah. and we picked up so much speed that it just like shot us off to the beach. Kieran, he wants us to face him in combat, not his Pokemon. Him. What are we going to do? What? <laughs> Try to throw him. <laughs> oh, did he do a little tripsy? A little tripsy dipsy? That was pretty good. I think we skipped over it, but there was like a text thing about how he throws people all the time. That's awesome. Got some fight on you. Your sumo needs work, but I see oh, some potential. Oh, okay. <clears throat> this guy's going to be 1v1ing a Hariyama outside. Exactly, yeah. Come at me, Machamp. You won't, you baby. Superstitious among us might even see your arrival as a portent of disaster. But you pass the trial, no matter how odd you may seem, you're part of Jubilee Village now. Dedicate yourself to the work of the Galaxy Expedition Team and complete that Pokedex. <laughs> but I warn you, Pokemon are terrifying creatures. Keep your wits about you. you I gotta like be strong like me. Like I mean, this isn't like. Oh, Edgelord, it's cool that Pokemon are dangerous. But, like, I like that, like, treating them more kind of like animal. Like, just like the... They're... You don't want to run into a bear. Bears are cool, <laughs> but you'd be scared. Yeah. You begin as a no-star recruit. In other words, you have no rank at all. I'm unrated. The director's cut. Ooh. The more you add to the Pokedex, the higher your rank will become. Working on the Pokedex will also, of course, bring you closer to your goal of yours. Seek out every last Pokemon. Just as God commanded. So Arceus says, so it will be done. We've also gained a Pokeball recipe. There's crap. One Apricorn and one Tumblestone. Cool. Here's 3,000 Poke Dollars. We still, we still have the same currency. See there, and then we put this in a savings account, and then we time travel back. <gasps> oh man, I put this in the first National Bank of Veilstone and came back 2,000 years later. <laughs> Crafting, making items from scratch, that's right. Whatever you need in your survey work, you'll mostly make yourself. Some things you can buy at a general store, but it's good to be self-sufficient. That's fine. Crafting is just the future, and I've accepted it. I feel like we've talked about this before. I, I like crafting to a point. I don't like when like, especially in RPGs and stuff, when like ultimate weapons are the result of crafting. I want that to be something I found. I want that to be some like legendary object beyond human hands. I like when you really have to work for it and crafting you really have to work for, but it's like, yeah, I, I it should have a little more gravitas than just oh here's all you need and now you get it. I like and like you know you can make getting the materials or whatever its own mythic quest. Yeah, like, that could be its own little little journey is getting getting all the stuff. That's kind of fun. Hey, I sell normal looking clothes. You can come to our shop if you don't want to be a weirdo. Is this the Jubilee theme? 
You know what? Honestly, might be. I haven't really thought about because this because this sounds familiar. I don't I don't know it off the top of my head. I couldn't tell you, but like I'm just yeah, I, I think I I've remember. heard this song. If this song sounds familiar, it might be. But as the soundtrack master, I hadn't even noticed that. But you're probably right. Here's our crafting table. And as for the money the captain gave you, feel free to spend it on whatever you like. I've already bought you a bunch of the stuff for the recipes, so just go and try it. Cool. Okay, and so the base camps where you can... So you can't craft stuff outside the base camps. Correct. Okay. But maybe they give you a way to craft stuff outside the base camp later. Do you get, like, your own little tent that you can set up? Mm, that'd be fun. That'd be fun. A little, little campfire, little thing. You did it. This you is crafted. so cool. Yeah, if I, I was if I was a baby who had just played a, a normal Pokemon game and was like, man, I hope they make a Pokemon game where you can run around and throw Pokeballs, and then this came out, I would lose my mind. There's a part of me that is like very jealous of children who will get to have this experience. <laughs> but it, I don't know if they're gonna even appreciate it. I mean, as you know much. what? That, like, that might also be fair because it might be just to me such a monumental thing because I'm imagining. I know our because our experience this. was red and blue. Yeah. Our okay, sit, sit, looking at playing in the car and timing it so the, the, street, the street lamp would light, uh, up. <laughs> light up so you can know what move to hit and hope you didn't get critted. But you've got to get through this damn rocket place, otherwise. <laughs> yeah, because then you're stuck you're there. You're gonna forget the what teleporter you used to get in the slip, stupid get room. the teleporters and the stupid push puzzles and slidey pads and all this bullshit. This dumb bad game that I love to play. <laughs> <laughs> and then you're watching the you're watching the show and going, man, I wish I could throw a pokeball. That'd be cool in It'd fucking be so twenty much years. Fun to feel like I was throwing a pokeball. <laughs> yeah, like the next level they need for this game is they need to then combine it with like the, let me use one Joy-Con and like motion control throw to throw my Pokeball. I like, don't want to alarm you, but that exists. Let me use that Pokeball uh, thing from Let's Go they Pikachu. Made, yeah, they made that. I know, but like I'm saying they need to put that tech in this game now. Oh, in this game? Yeah. That would be cool. So this guy also has just given us a quest or is going to request a, que a quest. It's a Pokemon Roll called Regard. Wurple. Isn't he? Hang on. Beauregard. Isn't that, isn't that Great Kazoo's name? Isn't he like Beauregard Q Kazoo or something? Uh, maybe. I could see it. He would. Uh, a Beauregard would call me Dum Dum. He's like, I think uh, po there's a phenomenon called evolution. If one of your Pokemon has met the requirements above, you'll be able to select the evolve option when viewing your Pokemon in your satchel. They don't just evolve anymore. It's something you tell them to do. That what? I have the power of of ordained evolution. I can I've decided it is time for you to evolve, child. Behold. So this guy wants us to catch him a Wurmple cuz he doesn't believe they can really evolve. Because he doesn't believe in evolution, we have to we have to prove it. Exactly, we gotta we gotta prove the theory. Oh, of evolution. so now and then all these people are like, oh hey, you oh, should go. You're going out. I sure would love to see a Starly in person, but I'm too scared to go outside. Could you bring me a Starly? I would love to see a Badoof. Could you get me a Badoof? It would be so neat if there was a Starly. I could be like, hey, you need a st you need to see a Starly. Oh, I need a Pokedex entry. <gasps> oh, that's right. Check. So, Pokedex. okay, so the Pokedex in this game is way interesting. I partially like and partially hate how it works. So in order to get the Pokedex entry, it's not <sighs> enough to catch the Pokemon. Yes. You've got to actually research it. You are a researcher Yes. Now. Yes, that's sick. That's so fun. And so in order- I love this. Yeah, like I, I think that is really cool. And like different Pokemon have different requirements and like, different stuff uh, no way oh my god this is gonna kill me that's yeah, awesome like, i i think they've gamified this in such a really fun way and like made the pokedex important again because i feel like it's kind of fallen into the back of what you're doing in a game usually i can't uh, think of the last time i went through the pokedex actively and looked at the stuff other than like i was a kid and i was like oh wow magmar's footprints I like i know i could beat up a 50 grown-ups <laughs> Yeah, like I, I mean, yeah. It's at a point it lost its novelty. I like I. That sounds really cool. 
This guy says he wants to see what shapes shanks have in their ears. What? Yeah, somebody had to make a little cutscene for all this. This is like a whole thing. I can't tell you what a relief this is. Felt like I had a bone stuck in my throat. Only the throat's my the brain and the bone's a thought. Only the what? <laughs> Thanks for helping me get the oh bone out. Oh my god. <laughs> Are you going to have a stroke, my guy? I'm not okay. done with this illustration, <laughs> young girl. Bone in my throat. I also, it's like, it's a very little detail, and I know Pokemon, like, has already named, like, every trainer you ever battled. But, like, everyone in this town has a name. Shinnan. Kip. <laughs> like, Kip. Like, they're all they're all named. They're all characters that's with, like, personality great. stuff. Like, that's, that's great. neat to me. They, they know the market research, man. People want characters. They want to draw. Oh, my God. Here's my fan art of Anth. Anth the Clothier. Here's my fan art of Anth, and it's just horrible. It's just filthy. Just filthy, filthy. Uh, but, you know, that'll get somebody to buy the game. Yeah. Hold on. We just got new clothes, and I want to try them on. Uh, That's probably the most important thing. It's to your right, to your behind, to your straight, to that right back. Isn't it that place? This place is the is the base. No, no, back. You were just by it. Right, right there. And to your left. You were, it's like right there. Is it this that, first, isn't is that it? This it? first house? I think it is. Yeah, I think so. I always forget what side of the town it is. All right, yep, yeah, you were right. It's okay. It's Behave a lot easier to know these things when you don't have to play it. Superiors are owed respect. Likes and dislikes are a luxury ill afforded. Those who are weaker <laughs> must be helped. Difficulties must be faced ahead on. Likes and dislikes. Nobody got time for that. There's no such thing. We got a fancy kimono. What the fuck? Oh my I'm god. I'm pretty sure this is like maybe not a pre order thing, but like a oh day one god. thing. Or we could have an everyday kimono. Oh my god. This is so cool. <laughs> which which are you feeling? I kinda like the the shaman. I mean, if I mean, if I'm honest, I like the default one because it's got my colors. But you, I, I think a Jehosaphine. If we're going with the lore here, as a devout, uh, as a devout, um, I don't know, worshiper, follower, Arceus. probably, yeah, probably, uh, goes with maybe. What's the other top? The one that we got, like the this, yeah. Something a little plainer. Go, 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 go! Do the fancy kimono top, and then what's the plain bottoms? The everyday trousers. What do those look like? No kneecaps showing. Yeah, no, no ankles. Okay, yeah, no, I can, I can understand that. Maybe we shouldn't show the, the toes either. Yeah. All right, yeah, I agree with that. This, this seems like a devout followers get up. I want to just, I, would, I just want to go outside and catch things. I know. Like, now you're telling me if I catch, like, 50 of them, I get something? That's all I'm doing. And so, like, okay, so if I catch, like, 50, like, that that's what they just said, right? It was, like, catch 25 of them, and then I, you'll get all the stuff, I think most of them end stuff, around, right? like, 12, 15, maybe. But like, you're not going to have these individual 15 copies that I could use? Is yes. It like, Those are just going to be oh. there. Oh, my God. But so, but I feel like I've encountered. What do I do with all of them? I mean, just have them. Yeah, you have them. There are some side questy things where characters are like, can you just give me a Badoof? So like sometimes you just hand them. But like okay, research task. Task you to carry out to complete the Pokedex. Each Pokemon species has a different number and variety of research tasks. Press the down button to open the Pokedex. Check the kinds. Da -da. Focus on a wild Pokemon in the field. You can press the ZL and instantly check the research tasks. <gasps> oh, that's sick. Cool. Catch and battle diverse Pokemon species and carry out plenty of research tasks. Do so and you'll gain research points and other rewards for your work. So that's kind of like how they gate stuff in this. You Like they said, yeah. we are a no star researcher. I think stars in this game kind of equate to badges. Because it's like I that I, makes sense. I encountered yeah. a uh, a bridge that was like you need at least like four stars to come through here or something. Ah, uh, yep, that's yeah, that's it. That makes sense. You're gonna have to dodge Pokemon, Karen. Okay, Ray this is, gonna is what teach I trained us. for. You're the you're the souls po pro professional. You got this. A timely dodge will keep getting hurt by fierce attacks of wild Pokemon. Yeah, how many iframes do I have in this dodge? Is encumbrance see, a factor? If I've got too many Pokemon in my pocket, will I roll slower? 
Yeah, you're probably gonna roll slower. Oh, you're carrying a golem? Huh, you want a heavy roll, <laughs> I like how this is our first official mission, and I decided we were gonna change out of our uniform. Remember Ocarina of Time when it was faster to roll everywhere? Yep. I don't think that's the case here. I was going to say, I don't think that's the case this game. <laughs> Focus on a Pokemon with ZL. Press down button. Open Pokedex. Like <gasps> this Bidoof here. Would you look at that? That I spawned right behind me. He's like, yeah, just catching one won't do it. Okay. Hey, hey, you. Hey. Come here, dude. Hey oh, I missed. Oh, oh you missed. Ah. Nice. Get there on. Hey. And everybody gets a little leveled up. Cool. Number of heavy specimens you've caught. That was a chonker. Oh, okay. So, yeah. So, we got to catch up to 25. Uh, defeat 15 of them. Heavy specimens. So where would our Bidoofs be stored? Where's our, like, party? Or, like, box or whatever? Our party is, is on like... us. We currently have two Bidoofs. So, if... Okay. We will, we will eventually hold more than... Or, like, you know, have more than six, and they do get transferred to a thing. Yeah. Which I believe... Okay. At our, like, base camp or whatever up there, I think I can swap them. Okay. Got it. Like, yeah, because I... Because definitely when I was playing this last night, I was just, all right, I'm catching every Badoof I see then. Cause, yep, yeah, all right. Because I need 25 of them, so let's go. I know. Oh, Grant, you're going to be playing this forever, huh? Yep. You got to gotta tick every box. Now, see, what has me concerned is, uh, like, for Rowlet and Cyndaquil, they also have the caught five of them. <laughs> like, what what, oh. is, what do you mean? Am, am I going to encounter wild ones at some point? I guess that's interesting. Wow! And like here, it like the little the little wind and their noises and the, that's so sick. That's so cool. Is that like a little little thing you can get? Yeah. I got a medicinal leak. Maybe I can use it for crafting. Laying it on thick, but don't forget to open your Pokedex when you focus on a Pokemon to check your research task for it. Just hold ZL, press down. Checking the tasks on that Starly next. One of your tasks is to catch Starly without being spotted. You can do that if you hide Ooh. tall grass. Give it a try. You know, it'd be, it'd be fun if they did, like, kind of like the Monster Hunter thing, where, like, or even, like, uh, the near, like, weapon stories things, where it's, like, as you filled in more of these tasks, more, like, lore or sentences Ooh, came that in. that would be fun. Like, slowly you get more text. Oh, shit. It's looking right at me, and I need to not be spotted. Turn around. Now, see, I could also hold on. throw a berry behind it. Is it going to see the... Oh, it's like, oh they smell it. What's they that it. smell over there? Oh, shit. Oh, oh shit. shit. No. Oh, my God. It noticed me. Scream. No, it didn't. No, it didn't. No, it didn't. It's gone. Well, get the one that's eating. Get the one that's eating. <gasps> oh, I'm ruining this. I'm ruining this. Come back. You got to... Uh, yeah. Oh I'm going to scream. I'm going to scream. I'm going to scream. I'm going to scream. No! Oh, I flew. Well, oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. He might, he might still chill out. He might chill out. I've been spotted, so I'm not gonna get that marked off. My bird. It's like, all right, fine, dum dum. Keeping its guard up. It ran away. No. Oh. All right. So that was that was that was a uh, that was that was bad. We we messed up. Starly, go. That was what not to do. Hey, thanks for watching. This has been Pokemon Fails. You just checked out me failing to catch a Starly. I'm embarrassed. Jehosaphine, who are you talking to? Make sure to like and subscribe.